of the greatest, that is a boy, yeah, that is a promise. Always wanted to be famous, just being real, yeah, just being honest. My haters won't always be nameless, give them no clout, I give them no power. Welcome back, best uni crew. It's your girl. So, today I'm going to try and decorate this cute little butter tray um, into a rolling tray. Miss so Hollywood did one and she made like a backwood one. I thought it was super cute. Your girl didn't want to paint nothing. So I guess I'm going to just kind of try to keep it simple. I just got some images of my choice. I um, found this image on Google and then I just added the high maintenance in the background to it. And then I got the image again right here. So I am using Paper Studios thicker vinyl. And I am going to be using some of my UV resin. I'm going to use a nail light as well. And the measurements, I, I kind of just did eyeball. Like uh, for this one here, it was probably like a two width, two and a half height type situation. And this one's probably like a three by three. I didn't know how big or small I was going to do it on this top part. But let's just get started. So you can get this from Dollar Tree. And you don't have to do what I'm about to do. You can do whatever. I'm about to saying that you got to do this. So let's get started. It's already been cut with Cricut. So I am going to be using a glue gun. And these cute little pearls to give me a handle. I'll probably just use this little one first. So I was thinking more of... You know, like halfway type of situation. Try not to get it on the curve. I was trying to find a better way to curve it too. But you know how that go. And I think I'm gonna just leave it on one side. I got the word high on some vinyl put the word high and we're gonna put a, a pink leaf beside it I guess so I'll probably put the word high up here So I'm trying to see if I want it there or kind of like folding over this part. And then I would have had maintenance going down, but I don't know. We might still do that, but the way I had cut it, it was so little. It didn't give everything it's supposed to give, honey. And I was just like, nah. So we might just put the little weed leaf there or something. This side here ain't got nothing. I don't know what to put over there. Start to wrap the whole thing. So maybe you just try to put it high here. And I get a transfer tape on that printable because it sure will um pull that um ink off. it so far then we get the little weed tree and it's gonna be pink as well probably should get it with transfer tape let's see let's try that oh, <laughs> Okay. 
And uh, like I said, I don't smoke, but I thought it was a cool idea for people that do smoke. And they can just kind of put it out and hide it underneath here. Even if they don't want to use it as a tray, they can just use it as a stash. It'll be a stash jar. So, that's cute. Okay, so, so we're just going to sit that to the side for right now. And then I printed this out now. I had two, but, you know, I was trying to use this piece of paper because I don't want to waste. And this measurement here was six by five, I think. And I just designed the size there. Hopefully, it's not. I tried to do it big on purpose because once I put it in there, I want to be able to cut the excess from around it. That's the plan anyway. So I'm picturing it going in here like that. They give me like a Zecto knife or something and then just cut the excess. Exacto knife or whatever. Let's see. Let's try to. So this is what it's looking like so far. Kind of want to make sure it's the um, like the edges are clean because I don't want it to lift up when I spray it. I want to make sure it's laying down everywhere. It need to be laying down there. Okay. So so far this is what it's looking like. So now I'm going to use a um, um, cellar spray. Okay. So I'm going to spray it. I'm using this Crayline Clear Glaze. I'm just spray a little light coat. That's just for my resin. won't eat through the paper. balls here and we're just going to put one on the top so we're going to be able to have something to pick it up with oh snap so I got my hot glue gun and I'm going to probably put it about right there and I'm just going to put it down there <laughs> super cute super cute Okay, so now, uh oh, let me use a little UV resin. You can use a bigger brush to get it, spread it on in there, even.
Trying to get it even everywhere. You can use your heat gun to get like a, a little loose. Okay. Not too much. Just enough. So, just trying to make sure there ain't no dents, like no dents in it nowhere. So, I'm just fill it in with the resin. Okay. Looks good too. You go ahead and put your light. So while that one's drying, I can go ahead and be doing this one here. And I'm just gonna use my brush just to give it like a cute little coat on the outside for the picture can be sealed real pretty. You want to make sure you seal that picture real good. Then after that, you can just do thin layers everywhere. Let me seal your vinyl. Sit down there. Keep going there with this one. Try to get this one some so we can go ahead and get some dry. Yeah, so far it's dry. I just be want to double check, you know? Yeah. yeah, that looks good. So, this is how it looks afterwards. Couldn't really think of nothing, but this actually turned out cuter than I thought it would. So it could be just a stash. You know how you have your already rolled up blunts? You just have them rolled up and put in here. So cute, right? <laughs> yeah, I have a blessed one. To infinity, then beyond it, I am a calm and no destination. A lot of things I am above, and there are a lot of things that are above me. Do not come for the people I love, cause then I get scary, then I get ugly, yeah. Ain't no problem when I'm the equation Present, loaded, observation I'm the new hit, we both creation Coming, find me, send it